how important is electricity to you for me it is extremely important i get to charge my phone stock my freezer with food work and all other things follows there's just always this special feeling you can't imagine the joy i get whenever i hear the light alarm life just seems to be going smooth when there is light But when the light goes off and there seems to be no hope for the light to come up for a couple of days, I get so destabilized, like I get devastated for real. Our light blew up last night. I heard the blast around 3 a.m. in the middle of the night and our light flickered and went off. I was so scared because I thought it was our transformer that got uh, burnt because I was just thinking we will not have light in the next couple of days and you know what that means. And I went outside that night I noticed my neighbors, all the houses in my street had light except my house. My house was blackout, no light. I got worried, really, really worried. I waited for morning time and I called um, an expert, my house electrician. He came around to check and he told me that there was no current in my house at all, that it was the Amot cable that draws current to my house that got burnt. And guess where that Amot cable is? it is buried under the ground for safety purposes because <laughs> it is called an amod cable because it is very dangerous and do you know the bad part of this whole situation we don't even know the exact point at which this amod cable blasted under the ground and you can definitely already guess the only solution to this problem Yes, that was the only solution, to dig it out and we dug it all out. You can imagine the stress and the work to look for the exact point where this wire burnt. We had to dig from the connection box of my house down to the pole across the street before we found this in the middle of the road, in the middle of our street. This was where the blast happened and it was so terrible, so, so terrible. I couldn't believe my eyes at first, but it happened. The middle of the road, middle of the road, middle of the road. The thing is smelly like it burnt. See, you can see safe, you see that the thing will catch fire. And thank God it's even underground. That means, assuming it was up, it would have burnt very well. See, open that place. Make it. So I think this is where they joined the, the two wires together. That's why I think it fire. Digging across the road was not so easy for me because I had to block the road for some time and also it's going to cause some inconvenience to the road users and my street people. I had to take um, permission from the estate management and it was a lot there was a lot of work but we had to get this done and thank god for the team i worked with they were so cooperative and they did everything so fast and we were able to get the job done but just look at where this thing burnt in the middle of the road
Someone sent me a laptop and it was out of the blue, like it was very, very, very unexpected because I have a very important project to work on. See guys, God is good. Just be prayerful. Be prayerful like whatever you want, whatever you feel like you are lacking or whatever um circumstance like anything you just need if you have something just put it out there to god and it will definitely work out things for you like god has been so great the job i'm supposed to do is supposed to be done on a desktop or a laptop so and my laptop is bad and you guys know what the time is saying now in nigeria dollar is not smiling i cannot just wake up and say i want to carry money to go and buy a laptop like do you know how much a laptop costs now oh god <laughs> laptop is very expensive even phones now are very very expensive like anything you want to buy now are very expensive because they'll use um dollar rates to convert it for you to nera i was just like if i can't get the hold of a laptop to do this job, I'll just return the collaboration. On the verge of um, thinking of returning the collaboration and all that, I was discussing it with um, some persons, like two of my friends, and I told them that I want to return the collaboration. They were like encouraging me, do not return it. Like they were so concerned, you know, this kind of collaboration, you want to return it. <laughs> Why? Because you don't have a laptop. It was so sad. It was really so sad that period. I was really, really, really very concerned and uncomfortable. And voila, Jesus, God came through for me. And one of those persons just offered to, uh, no problem now, I have two laptops. I can send you one. Huh? I was just like, are you serious? He said, no problem. That's not a problem. I will send you one of my laptop. And here we are. <laughs> here we are. A miracle just happened. This is so, so unexpected. And I don't even know how to like say thank you to that person. Because, you know, if something amazing happened to you, you will just only know that it's God. It's God working. Like nobody else is working. It's just God. Like God knew my heart. God knows how I felt that period. How I was like God knows how I really need this brand. That was why God brought them forth and God could not allow me to return it back because He knew I needed it and He provided a way for me to use it and to work with the brand and i'm so happy he will always make a way and he did and god came through god came through for me i am so happy i just want to say a very big thank you to the person that sent me this um laptop you guys should just also help me to say a very big thank you to the person like it's not easy to give someone anything in this period especially a laptop when everybody's struggling in this country like everybody's struggling and this person can easily say okay send me money i have a laptop that i'm not using i have two laptops and i can sell one for you for a cheaper price and the person will go ahead and do dollar conversion the dollar is currently um 1500 plus or so and let's say the person wants to even sell the laptop for $50 or $100, so don't worry, bring $100, that's just an example, bring $100, I will give you my HP laptop. Convert $100 to Naira, that's freaky more than $150,000, if at all, you understand? So, and this person offered to give me this thing for free. I'm just so grateful like God has been coming through for me a lot lately wherever stage you are in life just always say thank you be grateful to God that's all the only way you can get more is when you are grateful for the things you already have 
Yeah, that's the only way you can get more. It's because I have always been contented. I have always been grateful for where I am. Though I don't have the things I need currently, everything I need currently, but the ones I currently have, I am always grateful for. So, and God is always coming through for me. See, this opening of vlog <laughs> is already too long. I just wanted to show you guys what was in that package that came. So I will go through this laptop now and see if there is any upgrade for me to do. Then I will take it to GSM Village for them to upgrade it. But this laptop is fine and I love it so much. <laughs> yes! I cannot wait to start editing my videos on laptop. I cannot wait. Don't yeah. <laughs> money talking about me when I'm making money. <laughs> to leave the house i want to take this laptop to jason village for them to check it and do any update if there is and also i'll be going to the bank for to see my account manager he asked me to come and also i need to go to the same market to get um lush extension for my hair <laughs> this hair that we have been talking about since three vlogs ago <laughs> anyway i know i've been procrastinating my hair a lot but i'll surprise you for outfits i am putting on a track suit two piece i'm going to my estate gate to pick my tutor uh, she'll be teaching me on how to ventilate um, closures and fronters and all those health stuffs um, I paid for this class since January on January yeah or December oh no. okay yeah let me just say January I can't remember when I paid well it's been a long time ago and this is um today's date is august 18 i think so august 18 and magic class i paid for since since january i'm just starting to resume the class or oh, sorry i'm just starting the class today which is crazy if you ask me and ask me why i have not started since um probably i've been busy with other stuffs and I was not fully ready, so I'm just ready now. So I reached out to her last week that I'm ready to start my training. So she told me that she'll be coming on Monday, which is today. Today's Monday. And it's going to be more of like home private class. Then sometimes I'll be going to a place also. So, but for a start, since today is the first day, I asked her to come to my place. So I'm going to the estate gate now to pick her i'm panting <laughs> just because i'm walking oh, she's even calling me i think she's at my gate already hello okay just be walking down you will see me i look like witch with this hair i did not brush the hair very well okay she's on the other lane oh my this girl is fail uh, Okay, it's editing okay, for content creators. Yeah. Maybe <laughs> she's already. Isn't that your yeah. God wants to open your eyes? I said, that's how long you can come and bring the. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. And a small one can take it out.